So, and on top of that, I want to try to get a little help to get Uber so I can go to work later on today. If not, I'm just going to have to tell her I'm going to have to take the job some other time if she gives me the chance. But it's okay if nobody does. It just meant that God has a different plan for me, I guess. Um, a bunch of protection orders and stalking protection orders against a few people here on TikTok. What's too bad? That's what they want, right? <laughs> the bullies don't want me to make it. Just like they tried to get me last night. Morning, Brandy. I'm almost done with your picture. tried to get me last night. They tried to get me nana last night, but I appealed it and came right back. Nope, sure didn't. That's why TikTok gave me my live back. They're going to go to any lengths to stop me. And I'm just one heck of a strong person because I don't even know how I do it. With dealing with the bullies day in and day out. Somebody called my phone private call all night long. And uh, I must be made of steel because I, I keep coming back.
like I said, if it happens to where I can't make a tour today, then God's got a different plan for me. I'll just be on TikTok more, I guess. <laughs> Cause it gets awful boring here in the apartment. I know, right? I'm not gonna lie, this is totally mentally draining. But if they would have left me alone when I worked at KFC, I wouldn't be on TikTok right now. I'd be at work. Because I did have a job. For about a week and a half. And Dora the Explorer made me lose it. So, And she already admitted that. And I have the screen recording where she did. That's another recording that I'm taking to my lawyer. And we're going to be having court tomorrow over that. And other issues. So, as everybody knows, I don't have a family. To help me. My mom and daddy's already gone. That's the only real family I had. They sure ran over to YouTube to try to get all the videos down before I got them. No, I was the, well, there's Jamie, Jeremy, Earl, me. I'm the fourth from the oldest. I'm like the middle, I guess. There's a lot of us. And I guess there has to be that one fuck up in the crowd, and that's me. <laughs> I never wanted to be the fuck up, but. I am, and I'm also the black sheep. <laughs> and when I was out living in my car and doing bad things, you know, I chose to air my dirty laundry out on TikTok. And that's probably the wrong thing to do. <laughs> Well, the one, the couple, the ones that was very damaging to them, they tried to get off of TikTok, uh, off of uh, YouTube, but I still got them. But once this court proceeding goes through uh, tomorrow, they're going to have to take all that down because that's defamation of character, slander, because they didn't know it, but I was in their chat on YouTube. 
And um, I'm not going to hide it anymore, Jason. I have a fiance and his name is Matt. And we're not hiding anymore. I'm tired of hiding. Do I ask you that? Do I ask you? Who are you with? Do you have a girlfriend? Do I ask any of that? But it's not like he helps me, so don't get that twisted. And it's not like we can be like together together because he still has to go to a 30 day treatment and then to a man's um, sober living. He can't come here. So it's going to be a while before we're actually together together. And that marriage is like way far away. <laughs> because like I said, we can't we have to do our recovery first. How many? Oh, there's. There's eight of us kids. There's eight of us. Let me guess. That one was one of the bullies, probably. Probably. Wow. And like I said, I had to be the fuck up in the thing. And I think that's a really cool way for us to start looking at it, you know. Yeah, we're, we're going to be together in the future. And we don't want nobody but each other. But we're putting our recovery first. And that right there, that means a lot to me, you know. That he agrees with that. And... We're going to put our recovery first because it's the only way to do it. That way he don't cloud my mind. I don't cloud his. And I think that's a smart way to do it. And if anybody wants to bully me over that, go right ahead. But that's the only way I see us making it is we got to put our recovery first. And yeah, he might have done a lot of wrong things in his past, but so have I. Nobody has a clean, like, past, you know what I mean? But you do a lot of dumb shit when you're out there doing bad things, you know what I mean? And on rugs. That stuff will make you do some dumb shit. And I'm always going to put my recovery first. Always. But sometimes resources only go so far. You know, if they would have left me alone, I still would have been working. And if Dora would have left my job alone, I still would have been working. And I probably wouldn't be, you know, in the shape I'm in. Two months behind on rent now. You know, I mean, if they would have just left me alone. But no, Dora the Explorer called my job and got me fired. So. When they bring it to real life, that's when you know they have issues. You know what I'm saying? I'm so proud of your daughter. Congratulations. I can only be proud of myself because I don't have, like, 
a mom that's proud of me. I don't have family that's proud of me. And in all honesty, I don't need nobody to be proud of me but me. Because it's my recovery. And everybody does their recovery different. Everybody's recovery is different. There's no real textbook way to do it. You know what I mean? Everybody does their recovery different. I learned that in rehab because, oh my goodness. There's a little cuckoo for Cocoa Puffs up there. And if everybody believes what my family says about me, that's funny because my family has never, ever had my back for nothing. Like the whole time I was homeless living in the car, they knew where I was, but nobody would help me. It's pretty sad. And for me, that was just devastating. But if anybody would help me out with an Uber card, gift card, or Uber, that would be great. So when I get down at my lawyer's office, I can go straight to work. If not, that's okay too. Thank you for listening to me. Thank you for coming in and enjoying a morning cup of coffee with me. Is it raining anywhere else where anybody else is at? Raining here. Oh. Oops.
Yeah, it's raining here too. It's so gloomy outside. It's so gloomy. If anybody wants to buy any diamond art from me, um, hi, Jasmine. I'm about to be finished with um, Brandy's picture because she's doing her bathroom in like turtle turtles. And I had just a picture for her. Yeah, the rain does that to a lot of people. Hold on, and I'll show you this picture. I think I only got two more colors to go. And it's up here in this little corner. I have tons of diamond art left. I don't do picture frames, but I can do the picture for you. And then, like, um, you, of course, you pay on the cash app. And then... Uh, out of that money I use for shipping, everybody that has ordered one, and I've done one for in the past, they have received theirs. Brandy showed it the other day that she did receive hers. So everybody's a little bit more comfortable on getting one. Um, but here, let's show you. Hold on, let's show you. There it is. I'm just finishing up that little corner there. It's her turtle turtles. So, oh, look at that fake account. How about you trade me spots and see if you could live this life that you couldn't? But, and I'm selling diamond art too, so. And I have used resources. Good morning. Good morning, good morning, good morning. How are you? Hope you're having a lovely morning. It's raining here, but hey, God woke us up today. That's a blessing in itself. Everybody is raining somewhere, isn't it? Wow. It looks awful. Morning, Angela. Today is lawyer day. I just want to come on here and, you know, have a cup of coffee before I get ready. And tomorrow's court. So, 
I'm trying to get some Uber money so I can get back and forth to work today after court. So, well, after my lawyer. Sorry. So, your daughter is so amazing. I have not been able to stop thinking about her. I talked about her at the meeting and because everything she told me, I went in there and I was bawling and they were like, oh my gosh, what's the matter? And I told them that I just spoke to a person that gave me hope again and her story just just shook me, you know what I mean? And uh, she gave me hope and that's that's what I needed to hear. That's definitely what I needed to hear. She is amazing. Her story she told me just, oh my goodness. Sorry about that. Thank you so much. But no, Angela, your your daughter is like, oh my God, her, her story she told me just, oh my goodness. <laughs> she was amazing. Some people think it's just poof, so easy. This is extremely hard. <laughs> Tell your daughter I would love to talk to her again. Um, all the positivity she told me, man, I wish, I wish she lived closer. <laughs> She's definitely a light. She's a bright, bright star to me. I mean, she's just, she's amazing. you guys would have heard her story it was just I still get all teary eyed thinking about it all right hope your doctor's appointment goes well thank you love you be safe
No, nobody else is going to talk. Isn't that weird just to not talk in somebody's lives? Justine, quit talking out your ass because your mouth knows better. <sighs> and that is a prison thing when he was in prison. Okay, he's, it doesn't come out in real life. So you need to do your homework on that. And people do change. Thank you. And he was standing up for me for what you bullies are doing. So if you want to get the real story, all you got to do is, is ask instead of coming in here and spewing lies. So... No matter what you do, I'm going to stand behind him. Because you do some dumb shit when you're on rugs, let me tell you. Right. But anyway, I talked about your daughter at the meeting the other night. And, and she is such a blessing to me that I still hear her words on what she said right before we got off the phone. And... How she was saying how strong and beautiful I am and that no matter what comes my way, God's got me. <laughs> and her story just, oh my goodness, it was an amazing story. And like I said, if they would have left me alone and left my job alone, I would be still working at KFC and I would probably don't have all my bills caught up and everything. And I wouldn't be on here asking for Uber, but they brought it to real life and got me fired from my job. So who has the issue? Not me. They do. Oh, Tiffany Jackson. You know how many years ago that was? And when he did that, the cat attacked his his baby. So he had every reason to do that. <laughs> now they're on mat. So maybe they need to hear why he did that. Because the cat went like crazy on his son. And it's still not going to stop me. I mean, you guys can talk about him all you want to, but talk about him to his face or when he gets out and comes on TikTok. You guys talk to him about that. Don't bring him up to me because I'm still going to stand behind him. Well, that's wrong because Dora the Explorer just proved I have a screen recording on that, that she got me fired from my job. I was working.
You're just making me stronger. Come on now. I think you guys are a little bit behind because it was already proven that Dora the Explorer got me fired. And that's not doxing no one. That's using her TikTok name. I know her real name and we're going to be going to court over that tomorrow. Because I got to see my lawyer here in a little bit. And the advocate and everything, so. Because Dora the Explorer kept calling my job. They found out where I work and they kept calling my job. So don't come in here and start spewing stuff you don't know about because you're from that side too. Everybody already knows. I don't have to keep repeating myself. And they went as far as messaging me on Facebook, threatening me that they're going to get me kicked out of my sober living. What kind of people does that? Reddit is trash for all them trashy people that go reuse it. I don't use it. All it is is an adult playground where they can use childish words. They're not bothering me. I'm having a great morning. Another day clean and sober. They can't take that away from me. And they're not ever going to. Because I'm not going to let them have that much power. Mama, you don't want to go to Reddit. It's bad. You think they talk about me bad here? Wait till you go over there and read it. People have sent me screenshots and everything of that, so. Oh, yes, I do. I have the screen recording of her admitting it. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I have the screen recording of her doing it. I was saying she did it. I have the text message that she was in her little group of people and she admitted it. So don't come over here. In her own words, she admitted it. I gotta finish the V and the H's and I'm good. And then the whole corner will be done and this picture will be finished. <laughs> right. Sorry about that.
Hey, I'll be back. Uh, somebody's sending me something that I got to take.